in the garage. Today, as requested, I'm going to show you the mechanics and how this go-kart works. So it's sort of like a walk around of the engine, the sit all the different wiring, that kind of stuff. So first, I guess we'll start at the front of the go-kart. We have an LED off-roading headlight with all the wires up here. Here's the a fuse. I have to connect the ground and then these go to a battery, but I have to buy a battery for this. Uh, this, this turns it on and off, but I need a battery so that does nothing. This is the old kill switch. This is the brake system, so when you push it down, it pulls this lever. And then right back there, it clamps it on this little drum. I don't know if you can see that. Sorry if it's terrible quality. But you can see it on the drum. And then the gas. It's sort of the same thing. Push it down and it pulls on a little spring that pulls this bar right in there that opens and closes the throttle and the carburetor. And then over here, of course you have the choke that's run, that start. So this just makes it richer. So it pumps more gas into the engine when, when you're starting it. This is the fuel petcock to keep the um, fuel from stopping it from going in and out of the carburetor. So that's off and that's on. Carburetor is right here. Here's the fuel bowl. Um, and then right there is the throttle. Air filter is under here. You can't really see it. Exhaust pipe. I put on the muffler, as you guys know. And then there's a spark plug. It needs replacing. But it works pretty well for how it is. And then pull starter. So you just pull that and it fires up. But it has too much compression to do it with one hand. And then right here is the on-off switch. So that's off. That's on. It's off. That's on. Alright, and then I'll just fire it up real quick so you guys can see how it runs. Sorry if the camera is a little shaky. Put it to start. Put the fuel pet cock to on. Go like this a few times to get some some gas in it. Prime it once. Oh wow. Wait, sorry, I didn't turn it on. <laughs> huh. It might just have some low gas. It might just be low. I ordered new tires and tubes for my dirt bike, but those probably won't arrive for a while because of the coronavirus. So that'll probably be my next video. So sorry if there's not um, a video for a while. It's because of Corona and the shipping's delayed. All right, thanks. Have a great day. Like and subscribe.